I got this crazy wild updo going on. I don't know how I feel about it. But Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Amanda and I am back with another video. <laughs> Today we are going to be testing out another product that definitely had its moment in the spotlight, let me tell you, and we're going to put it to the test today. Mm -hmm. Is it just me or is like my highlight popping like crazy today? Damn! <laughs> Anyways, I got <clears throat> back on track, Amanda. So why don't we get right to it? Oh, do you see this wonderful new vanity behind me? <gasps> yes. This is my brand new vanity. I built this all by myself. Video coming soon. It's freaking hilarious. <laughs> As you can see behind me, I definitely do not have my vanity set up. So don't you worry. We are going to organize my vanity. We are going to organize the studio. We are going to decorate. We are going to do all of that stuff. But I don't want to not give you guys videos, right? Like that would not be cool. <laughs> Anyways, this right here is the wonderful product that we are going to be trying out today. And that is the mystical, I guess, pedicure in a bag. <laughs> No, but for real guys, this is the peeling foot mask. I'm sure you remember the huge fat about that because apparently it's supposed to like peel all of that gross callousy skin off of your feet without scraping it off or doing anything harmful with those blades and all that kind of stuff. It's just an accident waiting to happen for some of us. But seriously guys, I cut a piece of my heel right off using one of those professional pedicure like blade things, the one that you use to like shave off the callus part. Oh my gosh, it was horrible. Like the bathroom looked like a murder scene because it bled so freaking bad. So I like baby smooth skin without having to worry about cutting my freaking foot off, right? So this does say it takes four to six days to be completely completed. That's like a double wordplay there. Weird. So I am going to be obviously documenting every day, every other day. And then we will see at the end of the four to six days if my feet are like pedicure soft. So I think we should go upstairs in my bathroom. Let's get this started and see if it's worth writing home about. That's like something like your grandparents would say. Anyways, weird. Let's go upstairs. <laughs> Welcome to my bathroom. I hope you like it. <laughs> I'm sorry that the lighting might be a little bit weird. And I got you guys like stacked up on a few different things just so we're at like kind of the right angle. But anyways, yeah, so let's get started with this foot mask, right? <laughs> so it says here <laughs> that I have to wash and dry my feet thoroughly, carefully tear open pouch containing socks and rub them together and pull open at the top. Okay, this is like weird. Then number three is tear open the section containing stimulating essence. Uh, that sounds kind of dirty, doesn't it? <laughs> Anyways, and carefully pour into each sock. Okay, so what, there's gonna be like this liquidy stuff in the socks? I don't know. Four, place feet into the socks and tie them up around your ankles. Leave it on for one to one and a half hours. Whoa, okay. Remove socks and rinse off any residue. The feet will start to peel <laughs> within four to six days. Allow skin to peel naturally. Do not peel your skin off. Okay, sounds simple enough. So let's bust into this box and see what we got. 
Okay, I see. This is what I see in the box. So the box is empty. This must be the essence, I guess. Look how cute it is. They're like little feet. And this package here must be the plastic socks. Like seriously, these are plastic. It's not like material or fabric at all. <laughs> look at that's what they look like. This is two of them stuck together. So they it's like perforated here so you can like tear them apart. And then here's the little ties. Oh my god. This is actually cute, but like that looks like a serious winter boot shape, right? <laughs> and they're like lined and stuff. Oh my gosh, okay, okay. So I guess the first step is wash and rinse your feet thoroughly. So let's get started on that. <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to make up my little booty concoction, which I kind of forget how to do it. Hang on. Okay, so I have to pour this stimulating essence into my little booty socks. Oh, okay, see? Can you see the liner? Probably not, it just looks white, I'm sure. There's a lining inside the plastic booty so it's not like plastic on your foot. Okay, so apparently we have to put this in the booty. I'm just, oh, you can't even tear it open. I don't have scissors. Ah, that's okay. We'll figure it out. I got my fancy dancy hair cutting scissors. So let's, here we go. Oh, it smells like alcohol. And it says just pour it in, right? Okay. Oh my gosh, it is just like a liquid. Like water, weird, okay. So, <laughs> there it is, it's in there, right there. That's the liquid. So I think I'm just gonna set that and make the other one. <laughs> okay, got my booty open. Check. Pour it in. Oh my gosh, I wonder what this is gonna feel like. <laughs> here, I'll give you guys a ground close up. Okay, here's my clean feet. Booty number one. <laughs> Feels so weird. And then booty number two. Oh, it feels so weird. And then we gotta tie them up. This is what they look like on. <laughs> really strange. The liquid has kind of like absorbed into that fabric-y piece. So I'm gonna leave the baggy booties on for an hour to an hour and a half and I'll check back with you guys then. <laughs> so leave it to me to fall asleep <laughs> with those freaking plastic booties on. I went over the time. I'm just gonna call it a night. The booties are still on my feet and I'm just gonna jump in the shower and call it a night and go to bed. But I'll check in with you guys. So this is day two. Not much is happening. It's just like really drying. I was really expecting it to be like all gross and like starting to crack and everything like that. So day two, not much excitement is happening at all. There's the bottom. <laughs> so let's hope we get a little more action next time. <laughs> day five. Yeah, day five results for my foot peel. Just sad. <laughs> so, there's Hi. good old Bong Dong. Hi. Anyways, here are the results for day five. Literally, look at, dry as hell. I don't know if the camera's even picking it up, 
but like there is no peeling, no nothing. Here's the other side. Nothing. Nothing at all. Well, I'm pretty freaking bummed to say that the foot peel was a complete fail and a complete waste of freaking time. <laughs> but for real guys, my real final thoughts is, is it even really that practical to wait six days for your feet to be smooth? Was it really fun to test out? Yeah, it was because it was interesting to know if it's gonna work or not. But to be totally 100 with you, I would much rather have a complete spa day because that's just as rewarding and relaxing to me as it is going to the salon. I'm gonna do all me right now, and you could do your nails, you could do your pedicure, you could do face masks and everything, and I absolutely love that because when you can love and appreciate yourself for who you are, that, my friends, is everything. <laughs> Well guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, even though it was a fail, but I just want you guys to know that I'm not afraid to say a product sucks <laughs> when it truly does suck. Anyways, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button because there's so much new stuff going on. And don't forget to follow me on all my social medias. Ooh, and one last thing before we go. If you have any clothing brands or products that you would like me to try out, leave them down below because obviously I also want to try things out that you're curious about. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you for hanging out with me today. And until next time, bye guys.